Before Beautiful Minds, uh, I wasn't going to make it. About two weeks before coming to Beautiful Minds, um, I was struggling with uh, my alcohol addiction. I was trying trying to uh, taper it off. Um, my wife asked me to move into the other room, the guest room, and I thought that it was because of my drinking and because I was self-medicating, it was hard. I didn't have a clear mind and I wasn't able to um, look at the whole picture. But two weeks later, she um, came to me and told me that she didn't want to be married anymore. And um, three days after that, she told me that she was in love with another person. It was very difficult. I um, was isolating myself and started having depression um, and started self-medicating with alcohol for that. And that just made it worse. In the back of my mind, I, I still had that little bit of hope. I had been to Beautiful Minds once before, about a year ago, and thankfully, I came back and I was welcomed with open arms here and I have almost no words to explain the gratitude that I have for the people um, at Beautiful Minds. Um, Amanda and Mariola, my life coach, and Dr. Binus and um, Dr. Norman all have been there for me um, when it seemed like nobody else was. There are people that, that really care about me and that was shown over and over again i think that's the biggest thing is you guys accepted me for for who i am yeah god works in in um, wonderful ways i'm living proof of that <laughs>